Hi, Hype students and parents. Pastor Kent here with another Hype Weekly Update. This past Sunday at Hype, we had fifth grade night as we looked at the uh, chapter 20 of the Gospel of John. Uh, we read about the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Um, this past Sunday in, in our lesson, we talked about how the resurrection is the ultimate proof that Jesus is God and what he said is True. We talked about then some ways that we can know that the resurrection actually happened, like that it's not just a myth, um, that there are facts that we know that can prove that the resurrection actually happened. Now, if you weren't able to be at Hype this past Sunday and you want to listen to the entire lesson, I challenge you, I encourage you to go to Crosspoint's website, click on the Messages tab, and then click on Hype Student Ministries to listen to any of our past messages, including the one from this past Sunday. The challenge that we presented to our students and leaders is this, is what should our response be to this truth? And the truth I'm referring to is the truth that the resurrection is a real event, that Jesus is God. What should our response be to this? One, uh, if you have not yet accepted Jesus as Lord and Savior, an appropriate response uh, to this truth is to ask uh, to confess your sins, to ask God to forgive you, acknowledge that you need saving from your sin, um, and to declare Jesus as Lord and God of your life. And then secondly, um, if you have accepted Jesus already as your Lord and Savior, an appropriate response to this truth is to ask the Spirit to show you areas of your life where you still sin and desire to have control of your life. Um, and re when God reveals those to you, uh, I encourage you to repent and confess your sin and ask forgiveness in that situation as well. As we move to our next portion of our video, we move to our trivia question for this week. And our trivia question comes out of John chapter 20. So according to John 20, who was the first of the 12 disciples to go into Jesus' tomb? I'll say it one more time. According to John chapter 20, who was the first of the 12 disciples to go into Jesus' tomb? Text me the correct answer at 309-620-6606 and be the first student to do so so that you get that point and student with the most points at the end of this nine weeks gets that $25 gift card. As we wrap up this video, we just have a couple announcements um, for this uh, weekly update. First announcement is May 1st, this upcoming Sunday. It uh, will be our last uh, Sunday night program for Hype for this spring semester. We'll be honoring our 8th grade and 12th grade students as they are promoted if you're in 8th grade and uh, graduate if you are in 12th grade. Uh, each grade will receive a gift from Hype. Um, and so please let me know uh, via email at crosspointcc.org or text me uh, 309-620-6606 if you are planning to be there if you're an 8th grade or 12th grade student so I know how many get gifts to get. Uh, doors open this upcoming Sunday from 6 to 8.30 p.m. It's also a pizza party night, so please invite friends. It's going to be a lot of fun as we close our spring semester of ministry. And then our last announcement is that uh, we have another service project opportunity with the Heart House here in town. Um, they need people uh, to serve for their Race With Your Heart fundraiser event on June 11th from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. Uh, students who serve get a free breakfast um, after all the, the racers are done running. Um, if you are interested in signing up, please sign up this week. They need numbers of volunteers by May 1st. So there'll be a link in the video, uh, in the description of this video to sign up for that. So please, if you're interested at all, please sign up for that um, project. I hope you found this video to be informative and encouraging. I hope to see you this upcoming Sunday for our last Hype Sunday night program of the spring semester. And I hope you have a great rest of your week in the Lord. God bless.